Loss of brain function in liver disease. In this video you will know how liver disorder or liver problems created issues in the brain functions. I would request to every hepatitis patient to watch this video seriously. Hepatic encephalopathy is a decline in brain function that occurs when the liver unable to remove toxins from the blood, then toxins are reached in the brain. When the liver is damaged, these poisons or toxins can build up in the bloodstream and affect the function of the nervous system. These toxins, particularly ammonia, can cause a range of neuro problems like confusion, coma, and even seizures in severe cases. This thing happened in case of liver fibrosis or cirrhosis, which is triggered to hepatic encephalopathy. Symptoms of hepatic encephalopathy. Symptoms can vary widely, ranging from like difficult to remember, unable to concentrate, frequently forgetting, severe confusion, disorientation, personality changes, and even coma. Reason of hepatic encephalopathy. Chronic hepatitis B or C infection. Blockage of blood supply to the liver. Poisoning by different toxins or medicines. Constipation. Upper gastrointestinal bleeding. Bile duct disorder. Autoimmune hepatitis. Non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Diagnosis of hepatic encephalopathy. Diagnosis involves clinical evaluation, ruling out other conditions, and may include neuroimaging and psychological as well as neuropsychological tests. Treatment of hepatic encephalopathy. This issue mostly affected with chronic hepatitis B and C patients because their liver does not function properly. If you feel these types of symptoms, consult with your doctor. If there is any changes in brain function or severe, a hospital stay may be needed. Bleeding in the digestive tract area must be stopped. Viral infections, kidney failure, and changes in sodium and potassium levels need to be treated. Your doctor will try to focus on identifying and addressing triggers, supportive care, and reducing ammonia levels through medications. Hepatic encephalopathy can be reversible? Yes, it is often reversible with appropriate treatment within time though it is a serious condition. Progression of hepatic encephalopathy. Hepatic encephalopathy can be a serious condition can progress through different stages, from minimal changes to obvious encephalopathy with noticeable symptoms and, in severe cases, to coma. Impact of hepatic encephalopathy. Hepatic encephalopathy can significantly impact a person's quality of life, affecting their ability to perform daily tasks, work, and drive. What are tests required to diagnose hepatic encephalopathy? Complete blood count or hemocrit to check for anemia. CT scan of the head or MRI. EEG, liver function tests. Prothrombin time, serum ammonia level in the blood, sodium level in the blood, potassium level in the blood, kidney function test. This is important for people who already have a liver disorder. Hepatic encephalopathy can get worse quickly and become an emergency condition. Treating liver problems in every six months or as per your liver condition may prevent hepatic encephalopathy. Avoiding alcohol and intravenous drugs can prevent many liver disorders. It is a complex condition requires prompt recognition and treatment to manage its potentially serious effects on brain function in individuals with liver disease. So, this is all about hepatic encephalopathy. 
which is a dangerous issue mostly created by liver problems. If you feel these types of issues you are already suffering from, please share your problems in the comment box. If you like this video, please like and share this video more and more. Please support our channel. Thanks for watching Health Wisdom. We will meet you with a new update in the next video.